Yo, what's going on you guys? It's Savage, back from Battlefront 2. Today we're playing a mod called Tatooine Interception. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna just get started straight as Darth Vader. Oh man, we start off like this. But anyways, I just want to use this video just to, uh, thank you guys for 5k. Like, recently. Like, 5,000 subscribers. It's insane. It's in freaking insane. But, um, yeah. Thank you guys again for 5k. I can't thank you guys enough. But yeah, I just want to use this video just to um, talk about some stuff as in like what are my plans for 5k mostly like what am I gonna do for 5k because 5k it's pretty big in my opinion <laughs> and I feel like I need to do something big for the channel in order to successfully you know thank you guys all the way because every time I say thank you I I really do actually appreciate it but I don't know what exactly to do to basically give back to the people I want to give back to you guys in a certain ways. so if you guys have anything you want me to do I'm gonna I'm gonna get that sorted out. I'm gonna try to work on it, and yeah. So just leave, just leave comments or just let me know what you guys want to see from me for 5K because I want to try to get everything done as possible uh, as I can for 5K. So yeah, I really do appreciate you guys. But um, yeah, this is this map is by Bantha55. For those who joined my stream yesterday, you saw that I played this map. I never made a video on this yet, so I decided to just do it really quick. Well, not really quick because I don't know how long this is gonna be. But I decided to just, you know, do a video on this because it was recently the 43rd anniversary of the classic Star Wars movie, the OG Star Wars. And, uh, yeah, it's basically just me kind of celebrating that, even though it's, like, late. Well, I kind of celebrated it yesterday in the original trilogy, the New Hope stream. But, um, yeah, for those who haven't seen it, yeah, it was, it was pretty fun streaming a bunch of original trilogy mods. And this was one of them, but never made a video on it, so here I am doing that now, as you can tell. But man, this mod is actually pretty dope. It has a lot of has a lot of rebel units. Well, not really a lot of rebel units, but you can die pretty fast. It has a good bit of detail. It just basically enhances the ten to four map. It makes it huge. I have a feeling I'm in the yeah I'm in the back of the map, but it makes ten to four a lot bigger. Like I said, I think this is by Bantha fifty five. He's created Geonosis, Attack of the Clones. He created Empire Strikes Back on Hoth. That Empire Strikes Back uh, mod. He's created, what's that, Coruscant Droid Invasion for the Clone Wars, like, he's created a good bit of maps. Oh yeah, and the Naboo Thede one that I recently played, Siege of Thede, who created that too. That one crashes a lot, but this one doesn't really crash too much, which is amazing. But, um, yeah, this thing, this map is freaking huge. We start off in there for the Empire, when we capture this post. Where, where else can I go? I want to try to get to the front of this, but, um, yeah, you actually die pretty fast in this, like I keep mentioning. In all of Bantha 55's maps, you can die pretty quickly. Oh wow, there's an engine room, just like in space. This is actually pretty cool how there's like multiple rooms like this. I like this. I feel like the Empire, uh, yeah, the Empire, they definitely start off with a more advantage because they're basically attacking. Uh, this ship is actually docked in an Imperial hangar. Like if you go to the front of the bridge and then look out the window that you normally do, I'm gonna show you guys after I capture this command post here. But um, yeah, this mod, or this map is actually really cool. It's one of my favorites. It's not my favorite of all time because I haven't really played it enough, but it's definitely really cool. I like the Hoth one the best. Hoth and uh, Coruscant Droid Invasion. The Geonosis one, it's alright. It's, it's really big. It's really, really big. The Geonosis one. And the freaking Naboo one, that like that one crashes a lot, so I think that's my least favorite out of his. Out of his. Alright, so where's the bridge? I want to try to find the bridge. There's so many always. Oh, Princess Leia? Oh, we just took out Leia. I love how many hallways they actually are because it just makes the map feel so big. I love Tensor 4. Tensor 4 is like one of my favorite stock maps in the actual game. And just to see it like this enhanced is just like a big plus. I, I live for this type of stuff. And I love being Vader just over here wrecking a bunch of rebels as well. Because I don't know, it's just fun. It's just fun, man. I'm just having some fun. Uh, uh, I might get killed too if I get shot up a lot. Another Captain Antilles down. Antilles, that's his name, isn't it? Yep. Oh yeah, and the saber throw kind of overheats a little bit. It doesn't overheat for too long, but it still overheats in all the Bantha 55's maps for some reason. Or well, at least Vader's saber throw, to be specific. Alright, so yeah, here's what I'm talking about. Like, it's in an Imperial hangar, which is kind of cool, actually. You can tell this is based off of the movies as well. Well, the movie, not movies, because it's only in one movie. <laughs> this scene, at least. Oh, there's extra doors here. That's pretty cool. A conference, conference room has a little Death Star plans. There's the secret plans. Take them, Vader. Okay, I'm gonna use the use the force to get the plans. Hey, nice. I have the plans now. 
force push, force pull. I have like every single force power. Uh, that door doesn't open. Oh, where'd you come from then? Hey. Oh, yeah, so okay, I basically came from over there. Oh, jeez. See, the saber throw is so long in this as well, too. That's what I really like. I think I came from this way or somewhat. So many doors. So many doors. Oh, wait. I, already, I was already over here. So I came from here. What's that other escape pod room? Unless it's not actually on here. I thought there was like more than just one escape pod room. Seems like there's a command post nearby. Oh, this room. Okay, so I went that way. There's some battling over here. Oh, uh, these good boys are down. See how it has a little, uh, this, this is exactly from, this is exactly from the movies as well. This type of hallway as well. I love the detail in like all of his maps, man. I keep saying it, but it's just, it's so good. Oh, there's two of the same escape pod places. Okay, I thought it was the other one. But you know how the other one, oh, wait, what? Oh, didn't see all this down here. Let's go this way. I mean, I do know that there's a command post here. I should probably capture it, but you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep being Vader, walking down here. Yeah, it's mostly just me being Vader. Vader. So if you wanted to see me play as troops, then like, oops, didn't really do that. Ha, <laughs> make that flow. Troops, oops. Oh, you got this room. Oh, and there's that room. Oh, that's the engine room over there too. Okay, so I've been over there. Oh, this is neat, bro. I love this. And you got this room over here. You got extra control panels. Got extra hallways. What command post we lost? Uh, where, where's the command post that we lost? Oh, rebel scum over here. Oh, wow, I just ate that grenade. I just ate a grenade. <laughs> Vader come down this dark hallway. Rogue One intensifies. Rogue One music intensify. But yeah, thank you guys again. I just, it just hit me. Thank you guys again for 5k. Like, oh man. It's like I wanted, I kind of want to do a giveaway to be honest. So, but it's like, I don't know how to do that or what. Actually, you know what? I have an idea of what I could give away. But I don't know how to actually properly do that. Maybe I should just look up how. But yeah, I feel like I should do that. At least at some point. Maybe not at 5k, but at some point uh, down the line, you know. Because it's just, I want to give back to you guys, like, so badly. It's like, thank you guys for so much. You guys done so much for me by, like, doing these videos. And if you guys want to see more of these videos and whatnot, still, mm, I'm going to still do them. Like, regardless, because this is what the channel is. It is basically Battlefront mods. But if you guys want to see more stuff, like, I know some of you guys want to see some Man of War stuff, you know. Some of you guys want to see Force Unleashed. Some of you guys want to see Swotor, KOTOR, and all that. Empire at War. Like, I have all these Star Wars games that I haven't played yet, and I definitely need to play. Movie battles, I'm going to try to do some of that. Like, I'm going to do, I'm going to add more to the channel, but still do what I do now, you know, so don't need to worry about that. Now, I'm probably going to do a lot more of what I do now, which is basically mods and whatnot, but I'm still going to try to incorporate other stuff as well. Like, you know, just, just so everybody can be happy, you know? I like to every, make everybody happy. And, uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure some people probably want to see me struggle with the uh, the other Star Wars games that I haven't played, like Swotor. Some people may, might find that enjoyable, hopefully, if I stream that and whatnot, stream and whatnot. I know some people don't mind me doing like other games and whatnot, but like, I don't know. I, I don't probably don't want to really do that on this channel. I probably want to do that on something else. But that that begs the question. Maybe I should just get a Twitch and whatnot. I do actually have a Twitch, but I don't know how to set it up. And plus, I don't really stream on it, because, like, I don't know if people will actually watch the streams on Twitch, you know? You know? Because people watch this stuff on YouTube, so it's just like, my audience is on YouTube. But then again, I just have to rebuild it on Twitch, you know? So, yeah. Maybe if you, got, maybe if you guys want to see other stuff that I have that's not Star Wars, then I can stream it on Twitch and whatnot. But, yeah, but for the most part, I want to do some Star Wars stuff on the channel, so. Suggest some Star Wars related stuff. But, hey, we're about to win. Jeez, this is a big dub. Big dub for the Empire. Let's just take this. But yeah, it's too bad this map only has the same escape pod bays. I mean, yeah, this one makes the most sense. Because it was just like the ones in the movies. But, um, I wish the other escape pod bay, you know, the one, the circular one, that has like two two hallways or three hallways leading into it. Yeah, I think I like that one too as well. But this one, this one's the most popular one because it looks more accurate. Got yeah, escape pod. One, two, three. It's only like six of these. Yeah, six escape pods. Oh, we keep losing command pods. Only five left. But yeah, download this map. This map is huge. It's on Media Fire. For those who don't trust Media Fire, it's it's reliable. Trust me. 
like as someone who's been installing and downloading mods for like literally years using me media fire trust me there's no virus on here if you're afraid of viruses just get an ad blocker on your chrome extinction ex extension if I, hopefully i pronounced that right yeah just get that and you'll be a okay with this installing this on media fire so yeah you don't need to worry at all trust me i'm a reliable source i wouldn't lie to you trust me i know some people lie but i wouldn't lie to you but anyways hope you guys enjoyed this uh get got a little insight of what i want to do for 5k but anyway but anyways thanks again for 5k and uh, i'll see you guys next time keep subscribing but peace